The house was built, I believe, in 1858, and uh, it's just uh, one of the oldest houses in, in Lincoln County, one of the oldest in South Mississippi, to be, uh, to be frank. And uh, there's a great, great history here in, uh, in this old house of the generations that have been born and raised in, the, in this house. Well, we grew up here, living close to my grandmother, always had family gatherings here, and she never wanted the house to be empty. So in 96, I got the house and started working on it. And we started having Thanksgiving again here. Everybody decided that would be a time of a family reunion and we would all come home for Thanksgiving. When Evan came, he was the eighth generation to be in this household. And I mean, not too many people can sit on land that was an original land grant deed from President Buchanan. It's just a remarkable place and the family is remarkable, just as, just as remarkable the family is. I'm glad there is such thing as Thanksgiving because it reminds us all of what we have to be thankful for. I'm thankful for just getting to see everybody just and getting together and talking, hanging out. Thanksgiving makes me appreciate my family because I have a lot of friends that I know that don't do anything for Thanksgiving. It's no different. Family and time, you know, spending time with them laughing and, and joking, and it's great. Uh, well, I'm, I'm thankful for the, the morals of the family, the, the uh, togetherness, uh, the health of the family. I think I really am thankful for my family. Like, I don't know, they're always there. It's like a big support system in me. They're just, I don't know, so loving, so caring. Love of me, take care of me. Take everything by the side of my heart. I think family is love and togetherness. And I think it can go wide and deep all at the same time. To me, family is everything because they're always like there for you. Family is this big, wonderful group of people that I'm related to that. I really, really love, and we're always there for each other. We've watched our kids grow up over the years, and um, all, everybody's kids come together, and instead of um, you saying, well, who's this cousin or that cousin, all of our kids know who they are and spend time. It's not more than just being cousins, it's actually being friends. It's the family, the love that we share, the things we do together, and it's like year after year, Everybody is looking forward to coming to Thanksgiving. We eat, we take pictures, we go on a hike, and you know, you, it's just tradition to know that that's what's gonna happen. Well, since we had this tradition where the youngest is always in the back and I'm the youngest, really, I was always hungry. And now that these great-grandchildren are being born, I'm moving up a little, but not as much, and I'm still hungry. I like to eat Uncle Chris's German chocolate cake. When I tell them, it, it, sometimes it's as many as 40 to 50 people, they're like, what? You're related to that many people? A typical Thanksgiving day for me would be to wake up, um, get ready, and then come here and spend time with the family. and. Meet everybody, hug them, kiss them if it's necessary. <laughs> Every year we go on this hike uh, through the woods, and that's a lot of fun. Uh, generally, somebody falls in the creek or is pushed in the creek. Oh, the first hike I filmed, the, I called it the Bark Witch Project. Instead of the Blair Witch Project, I called it the Bark Witch Project. I'm often blamed as the prankster when we go on our family walks. I have gone through hours and hours of counseling when we return home because I'm falsely accused for things that cannot be proven. 
See, there you go. Throw it. Throw it hard. Here, come here. Now, <clears throat> there have been those in the family who have said that I am the reason for them getting wet or muddy. But that is just a diversion because they just want to have fun. They just don't know they want to have fun. I am here to make them have fun. So I help them along with that process. Uh, a little nudge here, a little stick there. It's all in good fun. I just like this is this really long Thanksgiving that I have. We don't have we don't have much Thanksgiving with my mama's family. So this is I mean this is probably the probably the best probably the funnest. Since we're getting married, you know, like two families have doing two different completely different traditions on Thanksgiving and we we just know that the Burks is important and so family tradition is really important. Even when we got married, he knew the, how important the Burke Thanksgiving is to me, and it always will be, and we just always make a point to be here no matter what, to see family that sometimes, I mean, most of the time we only get to see once a year. We do make it uh, a point to plan for Thanksgiving every year. It's important to us because um, family is important. We want to teach our children the importance of family uh, and continue that legacy that has been left behind for us. Being the older generation is marvelous. I look at the younger generation with smiles because they're picking up where I left off. When I realize that it's such a special thing that everybody is, has begun to make the effort, that's the part of the reason that I value it is, is because it's kind of a gathering and it's a unique gathering it's, that happens once a year. I've watched five generations in the 23 years I've been here. And it's interesting how this is such a godly family, and it makes me think of the Bible verse where God says he will bless for thousands of generations those who are the descendants of a godly person. So that makes me think how far back this family must have honored the Lord. Because you can see almost every family member here is a godly person. I do it out of love for family. <clears throat> and out of uh, good memories of my grandparents. I know what it means to my daddy. It's, it's family is what it comes down to. And my grandmother believed in family. And it's just a, would it be a sense of belonging, a sense of having some place to come home to?